medical dialogue sam mr zaman and today i'm going to talk about hope for patients with methyl malonic aciduria university children's hospital zurich is one of the leading global centers for diagnosing and treating methyl malonic aciduria or mma which is a metabolic disorder in which affected children and adolescents often use wheelchairs and do not always survive to reach adulthood patient samples from all over the world are sent to zurich for diagnosis in a large interdisciplinary project scientists from various Swiss research institutions study 210 biopsies in detail. They examine not only all of the genes which is DNA in the patient cells but also the RNA transcripts of these genes and many of the proteins. This is the first time that MMA has been studied using a multi-omics approach which is genomics, transcriptomics, proteomics and metabolomics. By opting to expand significantly their molecular investigation, the researchers considered not only the disease's genetic cause but also its consequences in terms of RNA, proteins and protein function. This enabled the consortium as part of the study to develop a diagnostic strategy that correctly diagnosed 84% of the patients examined. The multiomics data also showed that MMA patients use an alternative energy source to help deal with the fact that a vital enzyme is defective. However, in patients this alternative energy source usually is not able to sufficiently compensate for energy production lost. In in vitro experiments with patient cells the researchers succeeded in boosting energy production to near normal levels by supplying such an alternative energy source That's all for today stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues like subscribe and press the bell icon